And I think we're going to see a spectacular display of the handling qualities of the Chinook. Mount Flinders in the background there. The weather being very kind to us, thankfully. That great elephantine profile. The Chinooks here today flown by squadron leader Chris Beatty, DFC. A I 12 think, squadron. I think they almost kissed there, Jeff. I don't think this sort of thing should be allowed on television, do you? I wonder if there is some, uh, some purpose in what they're doing at the moment. In fact, they remind me of a, a pair of brogues, uh, in some form of mating ritual. There they are flying backwards, keeping an eye on each other, obviously. Very warily eyeing one another up now. Is there any way you can actually tell a male from a female Chinook, David, as far as you know? Yes, I think there is possibly one way. Both aircraft now are coming very steeply towards the ground. But I think we'll probably find the answer to that fairly shortly. And they move past each other again. There's a magnificent picture of the Chinook. And here they come again. Now, Jeff, I wonder if the relationship will grow any more intense on this occasion. Perhaps we should ah. suggest that if you're sensitive to these things, uh, it might be best to leave the living room at this time. Definitely a time to send Aunt Agatha out, I think. The way they are waltzing around here, And what would you think is happening here now, Jeff? I shudder to think. Well, if it was possible for one Chinook to cuddle the other, I'd say that's about as close as they could get. Obviously some meaningful dialogue going on there. Nope, they've made a decision. She's either rejected him or something or other. Well, how are we going to find out which is the she? And now one of the Chinooks returning and there seems to be a medical vehicle which is, um, which is keeping a check on what's happening on board this Chinook because it raced up and there's a medical team they're running across towards the Chinook. I Is it going to be a faucet delivery, do you think, David? Oh, I wonder if this should have an R rating, Jeff. Well, I think it probably should. Yes, I hear the patter of tiny Chinooks. And there it is. <laughs> so you have witnessed the birth of a new Chinook here on our program from the anniversary, the uh, air show at Amberley today. And the little Chinook looking quite happy and healthy, I'd say. I wonder how the mother's getting on. Seems to be not at all phased by the event and is departing immediately.